What's everyone, Tao here, and welcome to my channel. Uh, following Apple's iPhone 8 and 8 Plus launch, uh, there's a unique feature within those phones, is the 4K video footage at 60 frames per second. And now in today's video, I'm gonna do a quick test, uh, probably not that quick, but you know, yeah, do a test uh, to see uh, how long the phone actually will record uh, 4K footage at 60 frames per second. Uh, it's interesting to see uh, either the battery runs out before the storage is full uh, or uh, the storage full first or still have some battery left. Uh, now I have here is the iPhone 8 Plus, a 64 gig version. Uh, right now has about 47 gig left. Um, hopefully um, the storage is enough for this test. I have the battery uh, fully charged and let's do the test. All right, I have the phone set up here. Um, I need to show you the battery life is 100%, is right there. And also let me show you the capacity I have left, uh, just to show you guys what's exactly capacity. Now, right now it has 47.52 gig left. Uh, now hopefully uh, that's enough. I have a feeling Storage is gonna run out before the battery dies, but let's see. Uh, let's let me just quickly enable the airplane mode so it won't be disturbed. Okay, uh, and also let me show you the the 4K. It is on 4K setting. Where is it? Camera. Now it's 4K at 60 FPS. Okay, let's let's do this. And when you go on video, and uh, you will see on the top there, it says 4K 60. That means shooting at 4K uh, at 60 frames per second. Now I'm just gonna let the phone stay still. I'm just gonna uh, record it, and then I will be back to check uh, from time to time just to make sure it is still working okay let's start it see you guys soon all right guys uh, it just about 48 minutes in it's still recording uh, it's very good to see it's still recording um, it's not overheating I think I don't think Otherwise, it's gonna stop. Uh, let me just have a quick touch. Uh, new, it, it's just a little bit warm, um, but it's nowhere near hot. Um, they're actually doing a pretty good job to keep the heat down. Um, yeah, since it's still recording, the only thing I can do is just wait. All right, guys, this is uh, insane. It's an hour 27 minutes, it's still going. I can't believe this is happening. God. Um, yeah, uh, I'm not gonna check again. So th this will be, well actually it's not the last time I will check. The next time I will check, I just make sure it's dead. Either storage is full or the battery is dead. So this is taking too long. See you later. All right guys, I just got this message. The phone just recorded under two hours. And then this message pop up saying iPhone storage full. Um, I guess battery wins, storage lose. Okay, let's connect to the computer, see how big the file is. That was an interesting test. Uh, now I have the phone here with me. Uh, the first thing just to show you the battery uh, of the phone. It's about 45% uh, battery life left, which is quite impressive for almost two hours recording. Uh, now the footage is, here is the uh, footage, um, I'm sure you can guys see, very small, it says an hour 57 minutes, uh, okay actually see it's right there, it's an hour 57 minutes or something, 26 seconds. Now I'm going to connect these to a computer and then we'll find out the size of the file. Here we go. Huh? 
What? Wait, hold on a second. Wait. You guys need to say this. Okay. Right, remember I said at the beginning my phone only had about 40, 47 gig left ish. Check this out. That's the video I just recorded, just under two hours. It's 104 gig. 104 gig! Wow. Okay, let's find out why. All right. Um, I did a little uh, research on the net regarding on the um, file format of the Apple uh, Apple use on the new iPhones. Uh, the new format Apple use is HEVC or High Efficiency Video Coding. Now that is the biggest change in terms of the uh, new phones how the new phones manage or store the video format. Uh, hence, that's why this phone can cope 104 gig video footage in 4K at 60 frames per second with only 47 gig free storage left. Uh, it's confusing, right? Yeah. Now, basically, that HEVC is a highly compressed uh, codec, allow phones to store a large amount of data um, without a large amount of storage. I'm not sure even that makes sense. Um, but yeah, that is the uh, HEVC, uh, High Efficiency uh, Video Coding. Now, this actually is a great news for the uh, new phones, especially the iPhone 8, 8 Plus, and the future iPhone 10, because all three phones are capable of shooting in 4K at 16 frames per second, that requires a massive amount of storage, um, which is kind of difficult to get on the phone. I know you can get 256 gig on the 8 and the 10, but come with a cost. Now, it's this actually is a great way to record a long period of time of a 4K video at 60 frames per second. Um, for those of you who actually want to do it, now you know uh, the feature is great. Some of you out there may say, what's the point of doing a long uh, period of time 4K shooting? Well, in my opinion, if you do want to use a, a 4K time lapse, say shoot a 4K, a long period of time video, and they edit within the Final Cut or Premium Pro to do a 4K time lapse, this feature is great. It will save you tons, tons of money to buy the storage, or actually tons, tons of money to buy a phone. Um, but if you do want a use this feature, make sure you have enough battery power. Um, and on to the other point is the battery life is, in my opinion, is fantastic. It only consumes just over fifty percent of the battery life, just within two hours. 2 hours 4K 60 frame FPS. I have to say this is amazing. I mean, I did not expect this. Uh, well done. All right, guys, uh, thank you very, very much for watching. Uh, this is the end of the video. Uh, if you uh, liked the video, please be sure to share with others. And if you didn't like the video, uh, you know what to do. Uh, if you do want to keep update with my channel, please click on the subscribe button so you can see more video like this in the future. Um, see you in the next video. Don't forget to subscribe.